I've said this before and I'll say it again. I don't condone the violence that we've been seeing. I simply accept it as something that is inevitable when people feel a certain way. When people feel so threatened that they're willing to turn to violence, we need to figure out why they feel that threatened. To just state, oh, well, they hate freedom. You know, oh, they hate freedom of speech, right? Oh, they hate freedom. They're just fascists. Okay, what is that doing to help alleviate why these people feel this way? You can call them names all you want. You can say they should stop, but until they, in their heads they have a reason to stop, they're probably not going to stop. So what do we do? What do we do to alleviate their worries? You can say, well, we, we shouldn't have to, work to, 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 to focus on that. They should be like this and they should be like that. Well, that's nice. That's like praying. Yes, let's, let's pray for them. I mean, that's, it's, 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 it's just as useful. It's not helping anything. We need to find out why these people are becoming violent. If you feel that their worries are unwarranted, then give them some proof. Don't just tell them, well, stop worrying about that or stop being an SJW or stop, you know, something else, because that's just still, from their perspective, is just insults. How do we reach people who are this worried? What information can you give them that can stop some of their worry. The more we can disarm this, the better. But if all you're going to do is say, well, they hate freedom and they're just fascists and they need to stop. Yeah, you're not helping. What are you doing to alleviate the worries of the people who are being violent because they feel so threatened? That's what we should be focusing on, isn't it? Let's try to get some answers. Right now, I don't have any answers. We need some answers and we need answers quick. Because we don't want the government to be the ones to step down about this and start removing some of our rights as a result of this. So what can we do to stop that from happening?